this video, we're going to put Bluepoint Security 2010 through the rigorous 70 threat challenge. So you can see we have Bluepoint Security here installed and updated. This is our latest version, the new 2010 release. I'll go ahead and minimize that down. We're going to open up Process Explorer here, which is a small utility uh, that allows us to view all the processes and applications and everything running on this machine. So as you can see, it's a pretty clean machine. There's nothing really installed here other than Bluepoint. So you'll want to watch the CPU utilization and also to see if any processes run or execute from within our 70 threat folder. So as is normal with our 70 threat cha uh, challenge, we're going to go through each one of these threats, basically the worst case scenario uh, that we could possibly create, which is go through and click and run uh, these various rogue AV products, um, viruses, malware, you name it. It's a bunch of nasty stuff, essentially. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get started. So if our machine is indeed protected, when I go through these, you should see nothing running here that's related to any of these threats. If any of these are allowed to run, even just for a few seconds, uh, there's the potential for damaging um, our operating system or even causing it to crash, uh, data theft, any of the things that are related with malware, spyware, um, all that bad stuff. So we're going to keep on going here. Again, the goal of the test is either to get all the way down through the folder here and get the folder clean because our product is actually taking care of it, or uh, we end up with a crash machine, one of the two. I'm waiting on my folder to refresh here. Okay, we got one deleted there. Keep on going here. So I'm just going right on through these, and you'll notice a lot of them are being deleted uh, as I go, and that's what that error message that comes up is. I'll leave the next one up if it actually comes up again, just so you can read it. Um, it's just basically saying that the file's gone and deleted. So we're still going here. There's that message again. You know, Windows cannot find. Uh, that's because Bluepoint just deleted it, basically. So we're still going here. How many we got left now? We got 31. Still going here. And we're not having to really interact with Bluepoint. I'm just closing out some of these messages so you can see them as I go through. And we're almost done here, almost all the way through. That one's gone. Still going. And you'll notice very low CPU utilization here. Uh, so Bluepoint's very light on system resources. It's not a program uh, that's really going to slow down your computer and cause you any kind of problems as far as performance goes. Even during this worst case scenario, what we're doing here of just running all these threats, the utilization is really quite low. Looks like we're at 20 to 30 percent there as we go. Again, the goal here is uh, either destroy the machine uh, or get all the way down and have nothing left. Uh, as far as the threats go. And we're almost through here. How many we got left? We got 15 left now. Obviously we're getting a lot of uh, notifications from Bluepoint. We have the notifications turned on so you're seeing everything that's being blocked essentially. Clear some of those out just so you can see each one there. Or at least most of them. Popular screensaver. I know that's a nasty one. Some rogue casino software here. Close that thing out. Still going here, pretty much clicking on these just about as quick as I can here. You'll hear my mouse clicking in the background here just as I go through them. Almost there. Close some of these out. Casino software. And I believe that's it. That's it. So, I see blue point lighting up down here. Now you'll notice very low CPU utilization. Obviously our machine's not infected. We don't have any new processes running here. None of these were allowed to execute even one line of code. Uh, again, if any of those were allowed to run, uh, we would probably have an operating system that would be very damaged at this point. You'd be seeing pop-ups uh, and other related effects uh, due to the malware. So we'll open up Bluepoint here just to give you a look. Let me minimize these down here. You can see we're secure. You can see the statistics here. Bluepoint will always tell you everything that it blocked. Come over to the history here. Threats with various ratings. Everything's taken care of. We've got a couple quarantined here probably. Yep. And that's it.